Welcome you all to the Key Remini series where I share hope for her book Key Remini's to help better your day-to-day -day life. Welcome to episode 6. But before we get into today's episode, what even are herbal remedies and what are they used for? Well, herbal remedies are plants used as medicine. Yes, it's that simple. People use herbal remedies to help prevent and cure disease. People also use herbal remedies to get relief from symptoms, boost energy, relax, or even aid to weight loss. Now that you have a basic understanding of what herbal remedies are, let's get back to today's scheduled episode. Do you suffer from canker sores? Then this is just the remedy you need. Sage gargle. Sage is a simple remedy for soothing the stinging of canker sores. This gargle is also useful for alleviating the pain and itching associated with coughing and sore throats. This remedy makes 16 to 32 doses. Two cups of water, three teaspoons crushed dried sage, or six teaspoons chopped fresh sage leaves. Step one, put the water and sage in a medium saucepan and bring the mixture to a boil. And after that, cover the pan with the lid and reduce the heat, allowing the mixture to simmer for 15 minutes. Step two, remove the saucepan from the heat and allow the mixture to cool, keeping the lid on the pan to prevent the steam from escaping. Step three, using a fine mesh sieve, strain the liquid into a medium bowl, then pour it into a jar with a tight fitting lid. And after that, chill the jar in the refrigerator. Step four, rinse or gargle with one to two tablespoons of the mixture three times a day until symptoms subside. And that was the Sage Gargle Remedy for Canker Sores. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you try out this herbal remedy, make sure to comment your results down below and don't forget to like this video, subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss the next episode of the Key Remedy series where I share help for herbal key remedy so better your day to day life. And with that, bye guys. And with that, bye guys.